test and test and one, two, three. How we doing? How we doing, fam? on a moment. I forgot to get a knife. with a knife i mean i've been trained with knife to knife combat but oh no i still ask myself this every single day how we doing fam how's it going whoa 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 you guys can't see it i'll show y'all in a minute uh if you've been playing genshin they updated the client what wait the client now actually shows you the news without you even needing to launch the game Wait, that's so sick. Huh. Yeah, you, get, you guys can't see this, but I'll show y'all in a minute. I'll show y'all in a minute. Interesting. How we doing, fam? Whoa, well, welcome to the chat. Goras, welcome to the chat. Kiara. What's up, Lace? Mui, Kiara. Welcome to the chat. Hey, shout out Rose Daniels for becoming a member of stream. Welcome to the dream team or not the dream team. Sorry. Welcome to the unreal fam. Go on, you deal. I have to go. I'll see the one in the morning. Good night. Me now to get some good sleep. Good night. Good night. Okay, wait, this track is actually perfect for unboxing. It's just got like that suspense vibe to it. Yo, are right, we starting? We starting! Body pillow. I hope it's not a body pillow. Fam, don't send me body pillows. I don't like throwing stuff in the garbage. Pretty please. I wish I could like ship it out, but I'm not at a point where I'm at my own apartment where I can ship out to other people if there's something I, you, you know what I mean? So, uh, yeah, don't, don't send body pillows, man. Send that to the people that really want it, that can really use it, you know? Cruz, it's your birthday? Get, bro, you give me like 20, 30 minutes. I'm about to give you like a birth, a proper happy birth. Can I get a happy birthday to Cruz in the chat? I've literally used Cruz Ayaka art in one of my Ayaka thumbnails. An extremely talented artist. Please follow their Twitter. It's their birthday. Happy birthday, Cruz. I'm going to give you a proper happy birthday in a second. Hold on, wait a second. I just, I, I can't start the stream seeing that and not, especially because it's Cruz. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. 
Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I can't start streaming not. Chris has amazing freaking art. Just to showcase the art real quick. Look at this. You see that Beidou? Are you a real Beidou fan? If you're a real Beidou fan, you'll follow Cruz. Just look at the justice they did a Beidou. I'm just saying. Beidou looking like a bay there. I'm just saying. Yoimiya? Yoimiya fan? Like, that's not. Hold on. Hold on. Wait a second. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Show some love to Cruz, man. Happy birthday, Cruz. Look at the Ayaka art. Dude, this Ayaka art is so good. Happy birthday! Cheers! Cheers, cheers! Wait a minute, you were training hand-to-hand -hand combat? I've been practicing boxing since the age of five years old. My dad coached me in boxing. Um, and then when I turned... Uh, when I turned 18, uh, I trained with the Marines for fun for about six months. Not official, like, Marine, like, I didn't, like, go on deployment or anything. Um, I had the opportunity to, but decided not to. Um, that broke my heart. I really wanted to do it, but I have family and I'm more of a family guy. So to be away from family for too long and miss my brother's high school graduation just didn't feel right. So, um, I could have done a part-time Marine deployment, but that's not boots to the ground. I wanted to be a gunner. So, and a gunner, you, you can't go lower than a six year contract. And that was just too much time away from family. They wouldn't negotiate down to a two to four year. So it is what it is, but yeah, we, we got to train with, uh, with Marines for about six months for fun. Uh, I, I got absolutely beat up during that training. It's the most brutal training I've ever done. And they further did hand-to-hand -hand mixed martial art marine combat training for a lot of different things. And uh, yeah, I'm, I am a fitness health geek as I am a uh, music art geek. I just I like geeking out about the things I enjoy then. I, I don't know. I am I am addicted to a really good sparring match though. That's, that's why you will see me like handicap myself. In uh, some of these games that we play and purposely like masochistically like, you know, torture myself in a boss fight. I, I love a good fight, man. Both in game and out of game. It's just, uh, it's a weird addiction. I don't know. I can't describe it. <laughs> oh, man. Can't describe it. Can't describe it, man. Can't describe it. Can't describe it. Unbox it. I haven't unboxed it. I haven't unboxed it. We're going to be doing that soon. We're going to be doing that soon. But yeah, it's, uh, it's, it's been a wild life, man. And uh, with the lifestyle that I lived, whether I liked it or not, I loved it, by the way. Uh, I needed to know how to defend myself because I did not. Some of the neighborhoods I was in uh, were not the best neighborhoods. And I had to, uh, well, I was in fights on a weekly, weekly basis, pretty much growing up. Just how I was. New York City. If you're a city kid, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Yeah, because the Kaslana trained by Marines could probably go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Kevin. Nah, dude. Kevin would mop the floor with me. Listen, as someone that got absolutely, like, like, clapped by multiple marine sergeants, gunnery sergeants, lieutenants, like, do not, you know the things you see in the movies where they're like taking down like four to five guys like by themselves, you know, like a military person versus like a natural, dude, that's real. That's not like movie acting, no, 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 no. Trust me, they can take you down in 0. 0.3 seconds. Like you don't, yeah, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah, don't, don't, and if they're a small person, don't call them small. <laughs> You're about to feel real small to that small person is all I'm going to say, man. Oh, man, I got the absolute air knocked out of me so many freaking times, dude. <sighs> yeah. Yeah, but that, that, that's, a, that's a whole other, that, that's a huge story. Did you win the fights? I won 90... 86% of the fights I've ever been in. The fights that I lost, I got my absolute tail handed to me. That's a fact. But, uh, I've won the majority of my fights. Won the majority of my fights. I don't like to fight. I don't, like, like I like to spar. I, I love to spar. I've probably lost, like, 50% of the sparring matches I've partaken in. Because I purposely look for guys that, like, I probably can't beat. Um, but in terms of like fight fights, like on the streets, I've won the majority of those just because I, if we're going to get into a fight fight, I really didn't want to. And you did something that really required me to really, but yeah, that's a whole other thing. That's a whole other thing. <laughs> My brother-in-law is a Marine. A hey, cheers to him because the work that they put in is insane. The training that they go through is insane. It's bonkers, man. I used to come home with my hands absolutely just shredded from the training. It's nuts. 
No, it's not. So you do boxing? Dude, would you guys be down for like boxing content? Maybe that, maybe not boxing content. Nah, I can't have that on the main channel. Um, Maybe we can do like an IRL vlog. Like in the gym, you know? I'd be, I'd so be down for that. So be down for that. You know? I don't, I don't like fighting people. I don't. I like sparring with people. I love a good, you know what I'm saying? I just don't like when it's like personal. I'm not a... Not a personal guy, you know? I'm not a personal guy, I'm not a personal guy. Unless it's made personal, in which case, yeah. I wanted to join the military, but I couldn't because of the same reason Saving Prior Ryan was made. I was the last surviving male member of my family. Oh, I feel that. Day in the life of Unreal Dreamer? Soon, soon. I'm waiting for COVID to come up so I can I can actually have a normal day in the life. COVID's, COVID's weird right now. I have my vaccine, I'm good. I'm good, but. Uh, it's a weird situation in my city. It's not just COVID. It's a bunch of other stuff, financial things. Uh, so it's not like sus, but it's a little sus sometimes. I'm just kind of respecting everyone's boundaries at the moment. Um, but once that stuff gets fixed, you'll probably see a day in the life of Unreal Dreamer. Probably. That's not a bad idea. Not a bad idea at all. Only fight I got was being, uh, oh my goodness, a hundred times in school. Now, I've, I've been smacked around before. I've definitely been smacked around. Anyways, fighting aside, fighting aside, fam. How we doing? How's it going? Cheers. We got August 3rd. Alpha is coming, and I cannot wait for this character to come out. You know, I'm a, I'm a katana simp, so. I'm, oh, bro, I'm so hyped, dude. I'm so hyped. Um, and then Inazuma's out, and then we got Honkai Impacts Chapter 25. Axe be dropping soon. We already got the first act, if I'm not mistaken, and then Act 2 should be coming pretty soon, and Act 3 should be coming pretty soon, so that's gonna be, like, hyped as heck. Inazuma's been amazing. We're gonna check out Inazuma in a minute, but first and foremost, first and foremost, shout out. It's not my address, so it doesn't really matter if you guys see it, but This feels weird. I don't know how I feel about this. This is, uh, uh, I got this in the mail today and I was expecting it cause they DM'd me and they asked, um, I opened a PO box, uh, PO box will be shared with everyone soon. I promise. I'm waiting for it to get upgraded to a bigger size so I can accept more mail and I'm not bothering the mail people to hold, uh, too much mail. Cause right now it only fits about this much maybe a little bit bigger maybe about that big it's a pretty small p.o box uh the other big huge p.o boxes they're kind of kind of already taken so i'm waiting to get transferred to a bigger bigger p.o box we just got transferred to a bigger one literally yesterday but it's still not as big as i would like so uh yeah p.o box like address will be revealed pretty soon this was sent to the small p.o box someone dm'd me and I gave him the P.O. Box address for the one we had like five days ago. And uh, it, it's, it's, it's kind of crazy. Increase the camera size. Yeah, yeah, you're right, you're right, you're right, you're right. You're right, hold on, hold on. I'm so used to gaming. Okay, okay. But yeah, fam, uh, it's kind of crazy. I don't know, it's weird. Uh, I can't even find the words to this. Like, like I'm extremely happy. And I'm, I'm honored, but I feel a little undeserving. I don't know, man. It's so weird. I used to watch like my favorite content creators and send, you know, some gifts to my favorite content creators for them to open on stream and in videos. And uh, I, I feel this way every time I get fan art. It's just like, like the fact that anyone would want to draw me or or send a gift to me or, or dono to me. I don't know. It's like... Uh, I don't know. Part of me feels like I don't deserve it, even though I know I know we've worked hard, and I'm con I'm. I, it's not like a lack of self confidence. Like I, I'm, I'm a very self confident dude. Um, I know I make decent content. I know that I work hard. Um, I don't know. I don't know. And in my culture, hold on, hold on, hold on. We're a little off center. In my culture, uh, gifts mean a lot like gifts in general mean a lot but especially in hispanic culture like if there's any hispanics in the chat you guys can vouch like like a gift to a hispanic is just like it's like like triple the meaning you know what i mean that's a gift you know like 
So yeah, I'm just, my whole point of that, whole point of that discussion is just thank you so much for the support. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much. And uh, thank you for being a part of the Dream Team fam. That kind of sounds like imposter syndrome. Dude, listen, I think, I never thought I would say these words because I'm a pretty self-confident dude. I'm a very self-confident dude, borderline arrogant in a lot of different ways. Um, but, uh, yeah, I think, I think I have imposter syndrome when it comes to YouTube. I really do. It's just, like, I'll be honest. If we only had 3000 subscribers or 4,000 subscribers, I'd be like, nah, bro. Like I deserve 4,000 subscribers. We worked hard to get 4,000 subscribers that have like, like 23,000. We just hit, by the way, Hey, cheers. We just hit 23,000 subscribers on the cha channel which blows my mind um dude 10,000 plus is a lot of people that that just yeah i don't know it's kind of crazy it's kind of crazy i can't uh i'm trying not to get emotional uh yeah it's just really hard to comprehend maybe it is imposter syndrome i probably have imposter syndrome uh it's a lot of people man and I really appreciate the heck out of y'all. Japan, they treat gifts like an extension of one's soul. They treat it like little treasure. Yes, exactly. I actually didn't know that, Burgie, but yeah, that's exactly like how us Hispanics treat gifts. Like gifts mean so much to us from a culture perspective. So yeah, I'm gonna make a coffee. Hold on, hold on, hold on. It must be weird for someone who sends stuff to be the person who gets sent stuff. Yeah, that's the thing. It's weird for someone who sends stuff to be the person who gets sent stuff. Yeah, like I'm, I, yeah, that's actually a really good perspective. Like we make content for the channel for you guys just because I like to share the hype. So to get, yeah, it's bizarre. I don't know. You know, it, it's, it's, uh, it's pretty crazy. It's pretty crazy. It's pretty crazy. I'm excited for Alpha UD. I can't wait to see your. I'm all oh, so hyped for Alpha, man. I'm so hyped for Alpha. Hopefully next month UD will be hot 30k. That'd be crazy. That would be crazy. That would be crazy. Um. All right, we're unboxing. I'm gonna shake this coffee real quick. Buy Madrina's code B on real 20% off. Um, and then we're doing the unboxing, man. We're doing the unboxing. I'm a little worried that I'm being bamboozled with with the gift. That this is like a. A low-key worry of mine, right? But at the same time, like, makes for good content, you know? I guess. No, I, I, I trust the fam, though. I trust the fam. Show me your abs. We have a, we have a picture of my abs, as weird as that sounds, in the Discord. I lost a bet, so I had to, you know, show myself uh, post-workout without a shirt on. Uh, Aston Mods Unique will probably be able to find the pin for you. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it is what it is. It is what it is. All right, fam. Y'all ready? I know what's in this box. I think. I think. Unless they changed it, which is a possibility. But I know what's in this box. You guys don't. I'm very excited. I'm a little anxious. And uh, let's do it, man. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I'm 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 playing the gotcha the gotcha thing. I'm doing it. I think it's a sign of good luck, man. This thing has blessed us with C2 Ayaka. Like, nah, bro. We got the music playing and the jams playing. We got the coffee. Let the unboxing begin. Hey, this is from the fam. I don't know if you want me to say the full name. So all I'm going to say is Slayer. Thank you so, so, so freaking much for the gift. Thank you so, so much for the gift. It means the absolute world to me. Cheers. Cheers to Slayer. I'm not going to say the full name, just out of privacy. And, uh, yeah, man. Let's do it. All right. Okay. Nope. What do we got? Oh, 
Oh. There's a pool to open. Who would have thunk? Crazy man. Dude. Holy heck, man. This is going to be one of two. We're getting two of these. MG, shout out MG. He's setting us another one right now. Uh, he's already, he, he's had that one for a while now. Um, ah, bro. But hey, the packaging on the merch, man, I has got good packaging, man. Sheesh. Sheesh, man. Oh, that's wild. That's crazy. Can we get a cheers for Slayer in the chat? Oh, bro, that looks so good. Hey, wait, the quality is actually kind of... Wait a minute. I wasn't expecting it to hit. This is nice. Oh, dude, that's wild. That is wild. Take a peek at this, dude. Yo. Hey. Hey. It's going to be mirrored, but look. Striker full meaning though. Let's go! Raiden May! Raiden May! Let's go! Alright, number two! Number two! Oh, bro. Oh. 
That's crazy, man. Oh, dude, that's a nice jacket. That is nice. Oh, that feel. Oh, they got the patch right here. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Oh, man. Oh, bro, this looks so freaking dope, dude. Oh. Oh, bro, I've always wanted one of the... Uh, we finally got the Hawkeye Drip, dude. Oh, man. Check that out. Bring the hood down. And then check the back. The back is where it's at, man. Holy heck, bro! Oh, man. Hey, this quality is hitting. It's actually kind of nice. I haven't checked like what material they're using, but it feels really good. It feels really good. Okay, 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 okay. That's the one. This is the one you've all wanted, all right? This is the one you've all wanted. This is the one I've wanted, bro. If you know me, hey, and shout out Slayer for getting me this, and shout out MG. MG was the first guy that got the the. The Kiana jacket, um, Slayer and MG, thank you, thank you so freaking much. Having two is gonna be so nice, so I could always like be rocking this whenever I want. Y'all know how much I've complimented Kiana's jacket and been like, dude, oh, I've always wanted Kiana's jacket, man. Oh. Oh. oh, that's crazy, man. That's crazy. Y'all see that? Oh, bro. Oh, uh, bro, they got the... I've never even noticed this. They got the Neko charm right here. Check this out. Oh, uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Check this out. Check this out. Can y'all see it? Oh, dude. Holy heck, man. That's the Kiana jacket, dude, bro! Holy smokes, dude! Yeah, we gotta play Starfall. Hold on, hold on, hold on. That's a good idea. Oh, bro, I can't believe we got the jacket, dude. That's crazy! Oh, dude! I even got the Valk symbol on the back. Bro. Oh, man. Hey, cheers the Dream Team fan, man. We're one of the best communities out there. That's a fact. I'm lucky to have all of you, man. Thank you so, so, so much for all of the support. Oh, should we put it on? Let's put it on. Let's put it on. Oh, bro. I, oh, dude. I can't believe we actually got it, man. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Let me take off my hoodie real quick.
feels so nice too, dude! Cheers! Cheers, fam! Oh, it looks so good! Oh, bro, I'm gonna cry! Oh, I've talked about this jacket since we started playing Hawkeye, man. Go ahead, you gotta cosplay Kiana now. Thank you for the five super chat. Oh, dude. Hyrule, welcome to the Unreal Fan. Thank you for becoming a member. Oh, man. It looks so good, dude. MG sending another one, and then Slayer said this one. Shout out, Slayer, man. Thank you for all the merch, bro. Oh, this is so nice, man. Oh, dude. You're like a fresh bro. Thank you, man. Thank you, thank you, thank you. The hood, the hood. Oh, bro. Oh, it looks so... I'm looking at it from the camera. It looks so good. It looks so good, man. Oh, <laughs> Oh, dude. Uh, now we just need the Kiato bat. I gotta get my bat from downstairs. Nah, it's, it's locked up in the closet, so I gotta like dig through it to get it. Oh, dude. That orange accent is heat, bro. Heat, man. I can't wait for you to save Ark City. Oh, man. Bro, it's so good. Oh, man. Ah. Uh. <clears throat> Dye your hair white, dude. I won't accept this until you do so. <laughs> Uh, now use it when you gotcha, for real, dude. Oh, for real, for real, for real. Holy smokes, man. I'd love to dye my hair white, but it will ruin my hair, and I actually like my hair color. We gotta get, like, a wig or something. Best community, man. Best community, hands down, dude. Cheers to the Dream Team fam, man. Cheers to the Dream Team fam. It's actually really comfortable, which is weird. So like, I, 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 I'm honest with you guys. I'll tell you guys like how it is, right? Uh, I read reviews that the material was bad. I'm actually, I'm wearing it now. It actually feels really nice. I don't think the material is bad at all. I think people were expecting like a thick jacket and this is not a thick jacket. This is a nice, thin, like, like I feel like it's an accent piece, like a drip piece, you know? Which is what they do in city fashion a lot. In city fashion, a lot of the times the jackets you wear, unless it's like winter fashion, but if it's like like spring, fall fashion, you'll notice the jackets people wear are like super thin and light, but they look like jacket style because of the fashion that you can get from it, right? It's meant to be an accent piece. I think the, I don't know what the interior is because it doesn't feel like cotton. I wonder if the, uh, Oh, bro. Neko charm. <laughs> nah, not cheers to me. Cheers to the fam and the community. We got the best community around, man. 
Kind of like a windbreaker. Yeah, kind of like a windbreaker. Kind of like a windbreaker. Oh, man, you guys are the best, man. Thank you so, so much. Thank you so, so much. I'm biased. I really like this jacket. I've been wanting this jacket since I saw it on, on Kiana in the beginning. Dude, with like, like real ones, though, I talk about this every time it appears, man. Every time it were to pop up. Where's, uh... Uh... This one. I haven't listened to this one in a while. Hold on, hold on, hold on. This is a vibe. We gotta try the other stuff. We gotta try the other stuff. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, bro. Oh, dude. Alright, we gotta try the other stuff. We gotta try the other stuff. I'm biased. I really wanted to try a Kiata jacket first. Hold on. We'll be right back. We'll be right back. I'm curious what it's made out of. It doesn't say. I wonder if they don't want to share it. This isn't a material you usually use for jackets. On the interior, anyways. Interesting. We'll see later. We'll see later. This feels really good. This feels really nice. This might be like an 80 to 20 polyester to cotton ratio, maybe. Maybe a 70 30. Does it say? It's in Chinese. I can't read Chinese. <laughs> I can't read it. And this is really nice. I'm feeling a lot of polyester on this material. This is smooth. Woo! This is nice. This is nice, man. Oh, man. Oh, dude. It's a perfect size, too, because I'm trying to bulk up right now. Another 20, 30 pounds. So this should still fit. And it will fit even better once I bulk up another 30 pounds like I'm planning. So that's awesome. And then with the jacket. jacket's actually really nice this is really nice dude oh man oh it goes so nice with the shirt too nice and open oh man Woof. sheesh man wait how did you get the merch someone from the fam slayer i'm not gonna say the phone name for privacy Sent it in as, as, as a gift, and, uh, yeah, man, it's, oh, man. Oh, dude. And then with the hood? Whoa. Oh, man. This is nice, actually, for streams. It's not thick. It's really thin. It's a real nice accent to have for any piece. Like, holy smokes. I heard the jacket is made out of cotton. It might be cotton. It might be cotton. The shirt feels polyester. But the jacket feels definitely more like a cotton. Most likely. This material right here is definitely cotton. I don't know what this is. I'm not sure. It's really nice, though. It's a nice feel, man. It's a nice feel. I don't know how much it'll hold up. But man, it's really good. Electric fashion, electric fashion. You might get a crazy paparazzi when you go down the streets. Oh, man. 
Bro, put your hair in a pony. I can't put my hair in a ponytail. It's not long. I could before, but since I cut my hair and it's shorter now, it's a little harder now. A little harder now. Gotta ask Tesla about the jackets. Yeah, we're gonna... So, so I'm definitely wearing these during streams. Guaranteed. Guaranteed, guaranteed, guaranteed. 1,000%. 1,000%. Dude. Oh, that's crazy. Show me the tag. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, where's the tag for this? It's the jacket I'm confused about. I'm pretty confident the shirt is an 80 by 20 polyester to cotton ratio. I could be wrong on that. Take that with a grain of salt. It's just what it feels like. It's the jacket I'm like so confused on. We got the translator team here. Hold on. That might be hard to see. I'm not sure if you're actually picking that up. I got no idea. I don't know if you can see that. It might be too blurry. It's really tiny, the font. Really, really tiny, the font. I'm not sure. It says 100% on something. I'm assuming that's cotton. Because I feel cotton on here. So this might be 100% cotton jacket. Which means, ideally speaking, you don't want to throw it in the dryer. Ideally speaking, you just want to give it a cold rinse. A cold wash. And then just let it air dry. Keeps that, uh, keeps the design on there. Because if it's a full cotton combo, 100% cotton, yeah. If you, When you're dealing with 100% cotton, fam, you want to make sure that you're giving it a cold rinse and you're just air drying it. Because cotton can come undone if it's not a mix with the polyester and you want to make sure you maintain the design. So if this is a full cotton, this definitely cannot go in the, like, washer and heat dryer, 1,000%. 1,000%, 1,000%. Yeah, so like, yeah, we need a Mihoyo Global Store. That's why I didn't get the jacket so, like by myself. Um, shout out Slayer. Sh Slayer is an absolute MVP. Shout out MG for sending one soon in the future. Per Google for the Kiana and the Blue. Manufacturer Mihoyo product quality, 360 grams of cotton terry cloth. 93 cotton, 7 spandex from seller site. Oh, that's why it's so smooth. That makes sense. There's a PGR jacket I saw. I really want the PGR merch. That would be amazing. That would be amazing, amazing. Night night lad, you look fire in the jacket. Now you just need a hair of the board figurine. Get some good sleep, Sierra. Thanks for hanging out. Thanks for hanging out. Thanks for hanging out. Yeah, so all this is from their official merch store in China. So there's no way to actually like... I mean, there is a way. It's just really hard. Um, oh, that's crazy. Now we just need the PGR merch, man. That's all we need now. Wild. That Kiana jacket is nice though. This is nice. And we're gonna be rocking this on some days. But man. Yeah, the Kiana jacket is just, dude, it's just such a nice fit. It, this is just really, 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 really nice, man. Really, really nice. I, oh, bro. I would pay all the money for a Kevin or a woke coat. Call Mehoi and ask them for a global store. Uh, Zara, I promise you, I've been begging Mehoyo. I've been begging Mehoyo for Mehoyo merch. And I told them, I was like, dude. You, you don't even got to sponsor me or pay me or nothing. I, you send me merch, I will, rock, I will have it somewhere on the stream and I will be rocking it 1,000%. I will be your biggest hype man for it. You know? The orange really fits, you're not going to lie. Thank you, thank you. I'm a, orange is one of my favorite colors, so. Oh, man. This, oh, dude, it looks so good, man. How does it smell? It smells like new clothes. Smells like new clothes, package clothes. It's gotta get washed. 1000%. 1000%. Just, why y'all saying sniff? Kiana jacket looks good on you, man. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm biased. I really like this jacket. I've loved it ever since I saw it. Like. Hold on, hold on. Uh. Bro, every time I've seen this jacket, dude, 
every time I've seen this jacket, I just had to get it. And I, I never could because of, you know, uh, it's hard for US to be able to buy it. Um, oh, man. It... Man, Hollywood would make even more if they did merch internationally. I would pay for the extra shipping, too. I really would. Personally, I would. 1,000%. 1,000%. 1,000%, man. Oh, man. Okay, guys. Let's buy you need some Rita shampoo. Oh, my goodness, dude. No Rita shampoo, man. I can't waste that. I would have to use it, but... Maybe I'll, maybe I'll give it to someone else. I'll give it to some fam or something. To a friend of mine. So apparently there's a full attire, jacket, pants, and shoes, Hershel of the Thunder theme. Really? Really, really? Ooh, hold on. Hershel of Thunder. Make by... Not fan art. Hold on. Merch. I guess it would be shopping, right? Oh my god. Am I going to am I gonna go into sus territory? Monkas. <laughs> Hella monkas. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. I don't see the merch. I don't see the merch. We'll find another Hey, y'all seen the statue though, right? The statue looks really good. This statue looks really good. Can we get a link in the chat? It's complicated. Unless you're in China, it's really complicated to buy it. I, I'm, I'm not the guy that can tell you like how to buy it. it. It's a lot harder than just go in, cart, go out. From what I understand, I could be wrong, but from what I understand, it's pretty complicated. Um, Yeah, bro, take my money. That figure, I know, it's nice. Have y'all seen the Hershel Sentience figure? That one's nice too. That one's nice too. Kind of expensive. Not gonna lie. I can't justify the price. But ooh, if it was a Phoenix Fuhua. Sheesh, I might need a... Ooh, wait. Uh, real quick. This is what I meant. This is new. We didn't have this before. At least I didn't. When you would open the client, they didn't have all this. So now it tells you like news, which is dope. That's so freaking cool. Have you seen Hersher of Sensius merch? I haven't seen that. Hersher of Sentience jacket. Dude, the whole fit is so nice. It's like a varsity jacket, which I love. Dude, these jackets, listen. I love those jackets. They're, they're called varsity jackets, right? Oh, man. Baseball jackets, varsity jackets, like. Oh, dude. This is so nice. This is probably. Oh, wait, you're right. There is. Where did the graphic design on this? Chef's kiss. That's so nice. The graphic design on this is so well done. Typography, hierarchy, spacing, the contrast between the gray and the white gradient in the back with the color right here as a stripe. Bro, the hell knows their stuff, man. They really do. They really do. That's spoilers. Yeah, it's nice, man. Hashtag UD the drip king the official hashtag nah I gotta I, there's so much I gotta do before we can we deserve the hashtag man the hashtag man I have seen the umbrella the umbrella is dope hold on hold on hold on I've seen the umbrella the umbrella is really dope there there's two umbrellas I want so there's this one that's like a it, it's a man I wish they showed it here it is so they got this one which is like an umbrella blade that she has. And then there's also a uh, Alpha Punishing Gray Raven umbrella. They did one too, and this one is so sick. Oh, where is it? Where is it? It, it just came out, I think. No, they don't have it. Punishing Gray Raven merch, maybe, possibly. That's pretty nice. That is pretty nice, actually. I wouldn't rock that just because it's like, I like when it's just like like it's merch, merch like apparel type of merch, you know? Uh, I want one of these so bad, dude. Oh, bro, I would want one so bad. Where's the, uh, hmm. Where would it be? Where would it be? Where would it be? It's tough to find the merch. It really is, it really is. But yeah, like, 
Oh, man. Yo, you finally got the Kiana jacket from MG. Dope. This one isn't from MG. Is that the Kiana jacket? It is the Kiana jacket. Shout out, uh, shout out Slayer. I'm not going to say the full name for privacy, but Slayer sent this. It's our first ever fan mail that we've ever gotten from the fam. I sincerely appreciate all the gifts. We're rocking the, the Raiden May shirt from the Augment. And then we also got the Raiden May augmented jacket with it as well where's the where's the gradient you can see the gradient right here in the back dude dude oh man should i delete genshin for punishing gray raven that's tough man i can't i'm not the one to tell you there are different types of games i recommend trying punishing gray raven seeing if that's your game you know but that's tough man I'm not the guy that tells you uh, which to choose. I like both. That's why I play both, you know? That's a tough one. I couldn't tell you. I couldn't live without one of them. I need both in my life, but that's me. It's not as the 23,000 subscribers. Congrats. Thank you, my dude. Cheers to 23,000. Man, it looks really good on you. Thank you. Thank you. I, I appreciate it. It's, uh, it, dude, they did so well with this jacket. It's so, so, so good. So good. When Arknight stream, I wanted to do it this week, but we gotta we gotta catch up on the Honkai story. So, um, plan is for Ark. Well, actually, I need y'all to leave comments on the stream if you're watching this, especially if you're on Bod Squad. Uh, after the stream is done, I apparently Alchemy Stars and Ark Knights. I thought Ark Knights was safe from this, but I guess they're not. Um, both have like heavy copyright issues. Do we know if it's just demonetized or if it strikes? If it's just demonetized, I don't mind streaming both games. I don't really stream, like, for the money. Um, the money is just a bonus. Um, like, yes, this is my full-time career, but if I were to do those games, those games, it would just be for fun, you know? So I don't mind getting demonetized for those streams or those videos. Um, but does anyone know if they're strikes? Because I heard they were strikes. And that's, you get three strikes, your channel's deleted. It's, it's, it's gone. It's, it's to the abyss, you know? Um... Yeah, so Diego, have you seen the five dollar donation a while ago? Wait a second, hold on. Where's my phone? Did I miss a dono? Do you know if it was a dono or if it was a super chat? No, did I miss one? Hold on, hold on. Oh, I did miss one. Joshua, thank you for the five super chat. Here we get a cheers for Josh. The big question: First Shift Thunder or Ball? One v one. Who wins? That's tough. They're good at different things, from what I understand. Right? I I think we need to see more of Ball. Um, from what, ugh, it's so hard. It's so hard. I just haven't seen the Hersh of Thunder go all out yet. You know what I mean? Like, I haven't seen her like full power, like, you know, see the destructive capabilities of what Hersh of Thunder can do. Um, but Hersh are known to be like calamity, uh, like level, right? So I imagine she's got to be strong. I just don't know how well the Hersh of Thunder stacks against balls like domain, ex well, spoilers, we're playing Genshin today, so. Um, domain expansion that she does, um, and how that domain expansion affects others inside of it, right? So, I'm just not sure. I gotta see more of Ball to know. Gotta see more of Ball to know. It's complicated. It's complicated, it's complicated. Now, Hersh of Thunder is a Hersh, they're much stronger. There's just no way to know, though. Like, y'all have seen the capability, or they've talked about the capabilities of Archon, specifically Zhongli, right? In his prime, so... I don't know, man. Archons are pretty dangerously powerful. At the end of the day, they're both Raidens, and all I know is if they go at it, it's not gonna be pretty for the surroundings. That I do know. That I do know. But I don't think you can say Hersh of Thunder easy without seeing more of Ball, because the fact that just one swipe of the katana can completely reshape the land of Inazuma. Uh, she's a powerhouse, you know what I'm saying? But Hersha Thunder also has a very powerful, like, lightning attack as well. Her strike she used on Kiana. So, I don't know. I would love to see him go at it, though. I would love to see it go at it. I mean, Archons are little gods in their worlds, right? And we know that the Hershers are basically, like, you know, like, divine level threats to humanity because one hersher can you know bring about the end of humans period so um yeah 
Harsh of Thunder and Boss should be on par. That's my theory. The problem is May uses her power mainly on individuals while Boss shows her potential more on the world level. Yeah. Agreed, agreed, agreed. It's tough. I, I would need to see more of Ball and I would need to see more of Harsh of Thunder. I, we, I, we, like from what I've seen, I just haven't seen enough from either of them. So I wouldn't know. I wouldn't know. Yeah, Ball can split an island in half. May hasn't shown that power yet, at least, right? For all we know, she's like secretly the strongest Hersha in all of existence, right? But we, we haven't really seen the full capabilities of uh, Hersha Thunder just yet. Same for Ball too, because it, it was heavily implied Ball, what, not heavily implied, it's pretty much facts. She was holding back during our confrontation against her, so. Is that a Kia K Kaslana jacket? Just what? This is the Kaslana jacket, 1000%. Shout out Slayer. We, we we did our first fan mail unboxing and yeah, man, it's pretty crazy. Pretty crazy, pretty crazy. I think Paimon would win. I think Paimon's pretty, you know. The result is, oh, this is beautifully said. The result of Hersher of Thunder versus Ball is us common folk as collateral damage. Exactly, it's every risk. Exactly, exactly, 1000%. A thousand percent. I agree. I saw this meme on my Insta where a ball shows me how to summon. Oh my god. I seen that meme too. <laughs> I've seen it. Fine, I would one shot both of them. Easy, easy. Dude, imagine. Imagine, imagine. All right, fam, we're going into the game. Right, we're going to get some dailies done. So, Inazuma Exploration A. Shout out, Slayer. Thank you so, so, so freaking much for the gifts. It's absolutely amazing. I'm going to be rocking this on streams. From now on, I'll be alternating between all my fits. I love, I love switching it up constantly, and uh, wait, th I'm, I'm probably rocking this in the majority of Honkai streams from here on out. So we'll mix it up, though. We'll mix it up. I, I won't be, I won't be staying to just one. So you know, I mean, Siren almost brought upon the destruction of the world, right? Exactly, and you know, for all we know, Persia Thunder could be stronger than even that, right? But we don't know. We haven't really seen it, right? For all we know, maybe Hersha of Thunder isn't fully powerful because she doesn't fully uh, have that connection to the Gestalt will of the Hong. I like. There's just we need to see more of Hersha of Thunder. We got to see more of Ball. Like from what I've seen, maybe in future chapters, this 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 gets explained. From what I've seen, I haven't seen enough of both just yet. I am gonna send on us. I barely played any Inazuma so far. Hope you have fun in chat, babe. Chat. Or you will get bonked. Hey, thank you for, I got, for hanging out, Ardrick. I seriously appreciate it. When that Chibi Alpha out, I'll try to send you one. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. That Chibi Alpha looks so freaking cool. I'm so... Listen, listen, listen. Real quick, real quick, real quick. Okay. Before... I'm really hyped for this, okay? I'm really, really excited for this. Punishing Gray Raven. I, I made a video on this, but just in case y'all didn't see it. I muted that entire time. In case you haven't seen this, here you go. I'm, I'm muted. Y'all can't hear me. I'm <laughs> Y'all know I'm a Katana simp. Dude. Oh. Alpha's coming on August 3rd, dude. I can't wait. The jacket is increasing my Katana levels, bro. 
It's increasing it. It's not decreasing it. Dreamer, you're muted. <laughs> I see mute himself this often. I, I, you know, I got the face palm emotes in the chat. Oh no. Oh no. What a Kaslana Omega lol. <laughs> With the jacket it in. It's Kaslana moments grow stronger. Oh man. Oh, never mind. I'll stay for a second. Also, you're muted. <laughs> new Alchemy Star unit also. I know, dude. I saw the new Alchemy Stars unit. Alchemy Stars. Uh, is it Hero? Dude, everyone's dropping Katana, people. Everyone's trying to get my... She got a Katana, bro. Oh, hey, dude. That wallpaper is kind of sick. I'm just saying. Where's the real wallpaper? Hold on. Dude, yo, hey. Oh, dude, and this is the new character in Alchemy Stars. Also a katana wielder, like, bro, got the dragon in the back, like, shush, dude. Oh, man. I really want to play Alchemy Stars. I'm just scared, man. I'm scared they're going to... I don't want to get copyright striked, and I want to I want to enjoy the music. I don't mind getting demonetized. I get demonetized, it's cool. If I'm playing Alchemy Stars and Arknights, it's going to be for fun. It's going to be every once in a while. We hop in, get a little, little bit of variety, just to, you know, a little, little bit of variety sprinkled in for content. Um, I don't mind getting demonetized. I'm just scared of strikes. I'm scared of strikes, man. Same for Arknights. I want to stream Arknights, but I heard that they had a copyright issue as well with their music. And it's like, I get three strikes, I'm out. My channel's banned permanently. Done. No way to even like appeal it or anything. Once you get three strikes, you are finished. Um, yeah. You can always just talk to them first. Hit them up on Discord. I have a fellow content creator that I, I, uh, that I know of. Uh, his name is Zox. Super good content creator. He makes content on Alchemy Stars. And from what I understand, he tried to reach out and they were just like, it is what it is, you know? It is what it is. That's what they said on the Alchemy Star situation. Um, which, like, that, oh, dude, that's tough. That's tough, that's tough, that's tough. I really want to stream it, though. I really want to stream it. I don't mind if I get demonetized. I'm just, I just got to make sure it's not strikes. Once they get confirmation they're not striking people and they're just demonetizing people, y'all can take my money. It's fine. I don't care. It is what it is. I just want to have fun with the content. I just want to try the games out, you know? Have you ever played Azura Lane? Azura Lane is not for me. That's not my game. That's not my game. Um, our Honkai is the sole exception when it comes to uh, uh, an only waifu game, if that makes sense. And that's only because of the amazing stories and cinematics, you know? Looking good is that jacket. Thank you, thank you. It's appreciated. Shout out Slayer for the jacket. Shout out MG for sending another jacket. He was the first one to send one. Um... Uh, it'll be coming soon on that one, so... You need to take a look at Tier of Themis. That is a new, a new Mahalo game. That, uh, it looks good, but it's not my style for the most part. I heard that bots are striking people without Hypergriff's permission. Yeah, but I heard that those bots are from Hypergriff's, like, uh, uh, what do you call it? Uh, I, and I could be wrong, but this is just like the little bit that I've seen. Uh, Hypergriff Studio? So someone is accidentally like sending these bots out to like demo like you know copyright people. Uh, I just it's the striking that scares me. I, I can't I can't so if I get demonetized, that's fine. Nothing happens to the channel. I just don't make money off of ad revenue. That's totally okay. Like uh I'm safe when it comes to Honkai, I'm safe when it comes to punishing Grey Raven. Um I don't have a license to do like Honkai music, but Honkai's music is copyright free. Like, they don't strike at all, and they have full control over their studio, so... Um, yeah, so I don't have any worry with Honkai music. And then PGR, I actually have permission from Vanguard Sound Studio to actually like, cover the music there. So even if anything were to happen, like, I'm safe, I'm good. Um, sadly, Alchemy Stars doesn't want to give a license, which is bizarre to me, to creators at all. And they've been reached out by several creators, and they're not really doing anything about it. Um, I don't know if Arknights would be willing to do one. If Arknights is willing to give a license, that would be so freaking awesome, dude. I love Arknights music, too. I was going to do reactions of Arknights stuff this week, and now I'm like, man, what if I get striked? You know? Vanguard and Hoyomex are poggers. They're amazing. They're absolutely phenomenal. 
both of them are so and they make banger music man there are a lot of underrated arknight content creators actually i've seen a few i actually subscribe to a few of them i just don't i i try not to say who i'm subscribed to unless like i i also make content on the same game and i want to like share their stuff um i try not to show favorites but you know when when you're covering the same game as another creator you, you're gonna want to collab you're gonna have your favorites it is what it is you know um Arc Knights has great content creator, funny gifts, but the in-game grinding will discourage you from playing. That's okay. I don't mind in-game grind. I'm cool with that. I'm cool with that. I'm just I just want to see if the the gameplay of Arc Knights is for me. I actually don't mind strategy games. I used to play a ton of Fire Emblem growing up. Fire Emblem is one of my favorite games growing up. Fire Emblem and Final Fantasy. Like, uh, and one reason I want to try out Alchemy Stars is it kind of reminds me of Final Fantasy Tactics, which was a game I really loved. Really, 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 really loved. Have you reached out to Yostar and Hypergraph yet or trying to? I emailed them two days ago, um, but they're busy. They got a lot of stuff they got to do. So like it might take them a minute to reply and that's totally okay. Hopefully they reply. That would be so freaking cool. Um, but yeah, we'll, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. I love how Hoyomix deals with their music. Dude, Hoyomix and Vanguard are so creator friendly. They actually like, listen, uh, like, like. The, the fact that they give you explicit, detailed permission to use their soundtracks is why creators are able to cover their game with in-game soundtrack. From what I understand, Alchemy Star creators, correct me if I'm wrong, please let me know this isn't true. That would be awesome. They can't even play the in-game soundtrack, which is crazy. That's like, like, you know, music to me is everything in a game. Music, story. So like, if I can't cover the soundtrack, dude... I don't care if I get demonetized, but let me at least play your music, man. You know? Um, yeah, sorry, fam. Azura Lane isn't for me. It's not for me. I make an exception with Honkai with all the waifus because the story is great. I love the characters. Um, and the music is phenomenal, but um no, no hate on Azura Lane. It's just not my style of the game. It's not my style of the game. You know? Yeah, I remember I saw Vanguard said, welcome home on one of your comments. Dude, Vanguard Studios commented on one of my videos, making a music breakdown reaction on one of their songs. Um, what was it? I think it was Dream With You. Dude, I was freaking out. Oh, man. I was like screaming through the house. I was like, bro. Like they actually like were really cool with me making a video on their music, man. You know, when is the next Honkai stream? Tomorrow. Tomorrow should be the next Honkai stream. Uh, music story soundtrack, uh, Lion still gives me PTSD from GGZ, and yeah, yeah, I heard it's really good. I think, I think the Arknights copyright strike was a problem about a year ago, but I think it's all sorted out now. That would be awesome. After all, creators like Kyostin, Vian, Echo, Gen play the in-game music and are fine. Like recently, like, do you know if they made videos with in-game soundtrack and it's been good? Was it Narwhal? It was Narwhal? Did y'all see it? Oh, I was freaking out, dude. I was freaking out, I was freaking out. Seeing the next one is beautiful. Seeing the next world gets me emotional. Uh, Mihelio has conditioned me to like get emotional upon hearing that song. Straight up. You know? So you guys gotta go. Ray Varu, thanks for hanging out. Get some good sleep. Thanks for being a part of the fam. And thank you for the support. I seriously appreciate it. Yes, recently. That would be Pog. That would be Pog. Oh, dude. That's kind of hype. That's kind of hype, man. Now, Rexon is my god. Dude, did you see Rexon combat? Oh, bro, hold on real quick. This man is gone. Real quick. We're, we're going to get to Genshin in a second. Hold on. I just want to show this real quick. I want to get this good at PGR. It's going to take me a long time. I thought it would take me three months. I lied. It's not going to take me three months. It's going to take me six months to a year to even get close to this man's level. This dude is insane. Look at this. This is crazy. I... Uh, This is crazy. I don't, I, I don't even know, bro. I don't even know how he does this, man. Rexland, if you're watching this video, you usually respond to me every time I say you're insane at this game. I'm not that good, bro. If you're not that good, oh, please teach me. <laughs> um, you, uh, To me, I'm a pleb in comparison to you, okay? Okay, okay. Brands, 
Pokemon coming to the Unreal Fam. Thank you for becoming a member. Look how fast the enemy is attacking. This man doesn't get touched. Like, he iframes so beautifully. He dodges so perfectly. Like, the timing on the iframe to not get hit? Bro. Sorry the quality is bad. It's Twitter compression. This is a no damage run. Ruxan Simp? I, I Simp for Ruxan. I'm not even Man's crazy. Man is a blessing in this community. That's a fact. He does so much for the PGR community, it's insane. He's not getting touched. Like, this dude is literally not getting touched. And the enemy attacks fast. Look how it's swinging. Like, he perfectly iframes when the guy is doing a six thing strike. And it end the iframe ends as he's doing that six strike and does the back step. Like, bro. The amount of times you needed to practice and time that? Crazy. Crazy. Like, like right here. The man does a forward strike and he slides by it. Like, the, like, dude, the reaction timing on that is insane, bro. That's crazy. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Can we talk about the Vera gameplay? Yeah, this is a character coming out in the future, way, way down the line. Uh, it just came out in China, Vera S rank. Uh, Vera gameplay is super dope. Super freaking dope. I am definitely like, like going for her 100%. 100%, but Alpha is always the queen. Just saying, just saying. Just saying, just saying. Have you seen Chaotix Alpha's new skin video? I did, I did, I did. Dude, check out both his new skin video and then he just saw on Twitter, I, I forgot which server it is, but uh, in his new video, he saw on Twitter that another server is getting the Japanese alpha skin. Which means... Maybe we have a chance over on Global to get the Japanese alpha skin, not for sure, but that would be kind of awesome. There's hope. There is hope, dude. I hear Rexen in China was top 22 on something. I, if I'm not mistaken... He was top 20. I, I think right now he's top 22. I could be wrong. Take this with a heavy grain of salt. But I remember him sending a screenshot that he was number two at one point. If I'm not mistaken, I could be wrong. I could be wrong. But yeah, no, he's he's like top percentage. Insanely good. Man is crazy. Man is insane. You know, I'd open my wallet for that. Yeah, oh, me too. I, I can't say no to Alpha. I can't. Mm -mm. Rexen is good, but to be fair, as long as you know the enemy's attack timing, you already half won the battle. Oh, I agree, but the problem is knowing the attack timing, right? Like, it, it takes so long to get those move sets down. You know? Just like you're a blessing to the Ankai community, UD. Ah, uh, you know. Uh, I try to do the game justice. I try to do the game justice. I know my personality isn't for everyone. I'm, I'm fully aware of that, but... Um, I try to do the game justice. I try to show that yeah, it's a beautiful game, man. Honka's okay, got a beautiful story. It's got a beautiful music, beautiful soundtrack. Genshin, it's uh, after the Inazuma act, you can't listen. You can say whatever you... I, I agree with you. The, the story in Genshin was pretty slow for the prologue in the first chapter. But that's because it was the prologue in the first chapter, right? We're, we're going in chapter two. This is act two of chapter two. A. Story got real. Story got real. Mihoyo storytelling does not play no matter the game. You know? Does not play no matter the game. You know? It, it just doesn't. It's so good. Music, cinematics, like like foreshadowing, metaphors, art, everything. They go hard, man. Are we lagging? Oh no. Here, hold on. While we're here. Let me pop out chat and let me close this so we don't strain our internet. Poggers. Poggers, poggers. All right, for real, I'm going to add us. I haven't been able to catch up to Genshin's story yet. been trying to avoid spoilers for the longest. Oh, dude, leave. I might talk about spoilers for sure. Uh, but thanks for hanging out. Have a good one. Thanks for being a part of the Dream Team fam. I seriously appreciate it. 
Do you think PGR will have a darker story? I think uh, with where Honkai is right now, I, I really think that PGR and Honkai's are going to be just as dark as each other. Uh, I, I think right from the get-go, like PGR starts off dark. Like it's already dark right from the beginning, whereas Honkai, it's technically lore-wise dark from the beginning, but when you're playing the story, it doesn't seem dark from the beginning you don't really feel the darkness as a honkai player until like chapter three or four in my opinion um whereas in pgr you instantly feel like how like how dark and depressing the world is from chapter one right but like they're both equally as dark like after what honkai does that pgr does differently and which is why you can't really compare the stories too much because they're different stories right is mehoyo goes for this they're uh what's the word they go for this is what we want to show you but this isn't what the world really is right and then they slowly pull up the curtain on what to really expect from the story and the world that they've created with their mihoyo games whether it's genshin or honkai right whereas pgr instead they they kind of just throw you into the dark world right out the gate and you think damn the whole point of the story is just to be dark and depressed but then, like, as you play the story, you learn that the characters themselves are wholesome, right? It's, like, backwards. It's really, like, like they're backwards from each other. Honkai, they focus on the wholesomeness of the characters and their relationships. And, like, everything seems nice because of the heavy focus. And then they kind of pull back the curtain. Whereas PGR, it's, like... You don't you think it's just dark and depressing, but then like as you go on, you realize no, like the like they might be constructs, but they're actually people. You know what I mean? Um Yeah, PGR story literally started with the main protagonist bloody lying on the ground. Yeah. And almost dying, right? So I think both stories are great though. But you can't really compare them. The, you, you can't. They're different types of stories, and the way they're written and the strengths of both stories are completely different from each other. You know what I mean? Like, you know how, like, you, you, well, I, I, I don't know if you've read, uh, Rick Riordan books, but you know how you read, like, a, like, a Rick Riordan book, and you read, like, a, uh, and you read a, let's say, a Harry Potter book, right? Since they're, most people that read one usually have read the other. Um, the way they tell their stories is completely different, so you can't really compare the storytelling, because it, it's just a different style of storytelling. You know? I heard Arknights is super dark. Arknights is literally dark. The events are just a slide of delight until you get hit in the head once a new chapter of the main story releases. Yeah. I heard that... I, I, I could be wrong. I haven't played Arknights story, so I don't know. One of the reasons I want to try Arknights and Alchemy Stars is I heard the stories are pretty good. Um, Is that the way PGR... And again, this is just what I was told. I have no idea if it's true. The way PGR starts with it being like dark and depressing is kind of like how Arknights kind of is. Like it starts off really dark. So that's kind of interesting. That has me really, has me really curious. And I love the drip and the fashion, the urban street tech wear fashion, both PGR and Arknights have. Like the, the fashion is my style. So, um, yeah, pretty excited. Arknights is indeed dark. Arknights is indeed dark. I'm pretty tired, so I'm going to call it a night. Hersher of Flame Scion. Hey, thanks for hanging out. Get some good sleep. Thanks for hanging out. Thanks for hanging out. Thank you so much for the support. I seriously appreciate it. Doctor and Commandant. Yeah, and and uh, and Captain. And Traveler. I don't know. So I just got here. Is it ending? No, no, no. Not ending. Not ending. Not ending. We're, we're kind of just starting, to be honest with you, with the Genshin. We're talking about a, do a ton of different a ton of different games. You know, uh, you know what's the here? Here's the cool thing about our community and this channel, and what I kind of want to do, and what I've been trying to do. Um, and this is kind of of a hint to like my huge, crazy, unrealistic dream that is kind of starting to become a reality as we grow. Uh, but one of the things I really want to do when I'm playing these games that I play is like to help us as a community appreciate different games you know I, I feel like uh 
in every genre of gaming for whatever reason there's like this sense of like my game is better than your game in every community and even though that's super prevalent and easy to focus on i think people would be surprised how many people actually don't care about my game is better than your game they actually just enjoy games in that genre you know so i kind of want to like foster and continue to grow the fam and the community to be that one community that isn't about my game is better than your game it's just about we like to game with good story and good music and good you know good vibes you know what i'm saying like that like this is our genre we like to do you know so that's kind of been like a goal of mine is to really be that channel and be that community that if you're a gamer that doesn't care about comparing and just likes to enjoy multiple games like that's a cool thing that's totally cool that's okay yeah there's a lot of people like that just watch honkai versus again yeah it, bro it blows my mind how people really get into honkai versus genshin when they're made by the same company dude bro y'all are we're on the same team why are we fighting each other oh man it's like, don't you realize the more money Genshin makes, like, the, the, that means the more attention, the more money that Honkai is going to make. And then the more money Honkai makes, and that means the more attention the money Genshin is going to make. And it's going to be a win-win situation, you know? It's a win-win situation, you know? So, yeah, it's, it's, it's bizarre. I don't know. It, it really is. It really, yeah, let's just enjoy and appreciate the games. Exactly. Now, the first time I knew about your channel, I was desperately finding a channel reaction to Honkai trailer way before you got 9.5k and then followed you since. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. 100%. Apparently, Chaotic also liked Arknights. The Chibi only disappointed him about the character designs. He loved them. Oh, I don't blame him. I, I definitely prefer, like, just being real with you, I prefer, like, the full, like, 3D model or like the the 2d model of like like the punishing gray raven like the art like this right i prefer this um over chibi but if the story is good like i don't mind it like i played i played fire emblem like my whole life growing up and final fantasy and they did a lot of chibi stuff so you know whoa ray but the 500 super chat thank you so much whoa Thank you, thank you, thank you! Cheers with the 500 pesos! Holy heck! Thank you, my dude! Oh, man. Don't even mention Arknights vs. Alchemy Stars. Yeah, I noticed people doing Ar Arknights vs. Alchemy Stars. I'm like, they both look like good games. Let's enjoy both games, you know? It's kind of what I want to do. The, the only thing is, like, I get a lot of hate for that. Since... Since I'm diving into multiple games, it's like a lot of people are like, oh, bro, like, like, I, like I used to have, like, I, I know people that are a part of the fam that were really cool with me until I started making more Genshin videos or until I started making more PGR videos. And then they're mad that I made PGR videos and Genshin videos because uh, they thought that I was a Honkai only person. And it's like, I love Honkai still. That that my love for Honkai hasn't even dipped at all, right? Um Yeah, but it, it, I don't know. It's so weird. It's so bizarre, man. You find it hard juggling a ton of the gotchas you're playing? Not at all. Um I don't think so. I'm now like a hard like I'm going to go a little hardcore on PGR like gameplay-wise at like end game cuz I'm pretty addicted to the combat, but for the most part like yeah, I'm pretty chill, but that's because this is my full-time job um thanks to you guys like you guys changed my life um so i i haven't had too much time like juggling everything what's been hard for me is not juggling the gameplay it's juggling the content so like i want to make so much content but it's not possible as one man it's not it's not it's not it's not it's not um 
So I'm, I want to bring on like an editor or two in the future. I don't know when I'm going to do it. It might be soon. It might be later. I have no idea. Ayaka's voice is an absolute godsend. Sheesh. Um, that way we can make a ton of content. And I can I can make all the content that I want to make. You can only do it. Yeah, you can only do so much. You can only do so much. I can easily stream everything. But to make videos on, on featuring the beautiful stories and music that these games have, it's a little hard. A little hard it's a little hard why would someone leave you for what game you play that's dumb i mean i, I can I, I understand you know i i totally get it um totally understand i do i do i do so you want to make sure that like as a viewer as a fellow viewer sometimes you want to follow a channel to be that specialist channel you know um so i can totally see if like you know if that's the case but uh yeah it's it, it's weird how people do get mad about it though that's a little weird you know, I personally can't bring myself to like Genshin due to certain artistic choices, but I see no issues with others like UD enjoying it. Right. And that's totally cool with us liking different art styles and different, uh, uh, what do you call it? Different games, different stories, different music, you know, like even though Genshin and Honkai are Mihoyo games, a lot of the things that they do are very different from each other, you know? Um, oh boy, this is not, the, this is one of the hardest mechanics of this boss. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, wait. Oh! I'm trying to get them all together. Beautiful. Get this. And then charge that. Kazuha. Nice. Come back down. Beautiful. Okay, that's down. Wait, is it this? And then pop the ultimate. Nice. Dude, Ayaka Kazuha combo is, is one of the most disgusting things in this game, hands down. It's it's pretty nasty. Okay. Dude, Joshua with the 20 super chat! Elf Academy and cooking with the Valk season two. Can I DM you something sometime? Dude, 100%. DM me on Twitter, because on Discord it's 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 hard on Twitter too, but it's almost impossible for me to see your Discord DM. Sometimes I see it, sometimes most of the time I don't. I I get like 200, 300 DMs on Discord a day. It's pretty insane. Um, don't feel bad for sending me DMs. Feel feel free to send me DMs. There's a reason why DMs are open. But I, on Discord, we just got so many people on the Discord server. I think we are hitting 3,500 people. It's it's pretty hard. It's pretty hard to catch up with it all. It's easier on Twitter because I barely get any Twitter DMs. Um, I get I get I get a good amount, like 20 or 30 a day. But but it, it's easier to catch up with those. You know, they. They take me a little time to catch up with everyone, though. Not gonna lie. Elf Academy and Cooking with the, with the Valkyries Season 2 will happen. On a celebration stream. I don't know when, but we will do it. Arc Knights is a visual novel. Look to it for cutscenes. Oh, so kind of like PGR. PGR gives me like that, that visual novel type of storytelling that I really... I used to enjoy as a kid a ton. I haven't really done much of it lately, but now with PGR, I've been able to like re-enjoy that, you know? Has you been watching Elf Academy? I haven't seen it yet. I've seen a few of the memes, but I haven't seen it. You know? Now you will have 300 DMs and possibly, possibly. Every time I say that, I do get a lot of DMs. They can speak for a lot of people when we say we discovered your channel through the games you play, but we stick around for your energetic personality. I appreciate it, man. Thank you, thank you. I love how you analyze the music. I appreciate that you enjoy me geeking out about the music. I'm not professionally trained, so, you know, take everything I say with a grain of salt always, but, um, you know, I'm a music geek, so... I like to give my interpretation of it and just share like my hype for it, you know? And a lot of the times I'm wrong, some of the times I'm right. And uh, yeah, it's it's just fun to do. It's okay to be wrong, fam. It's okay to be wrong, contrary to popular belief. No, I I thought I was out of there, man. Got this, this is gonna smack me in a second. Okay, he's gonna come back down. Beautiful. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm gonna bring you back. Okay, I have mixed feelings on Ayaka's dash. I actually like the dash a lot. I just don't like it for combat. But I also like it for combat. I like the way it moves. I don't like that I can't iframe with it. That drives me a little insane. That, like, the iframing feels very off on Ayaka's dash. But... 
but I will say it's a lot of fun in combat though. Even though I can't iframe it, the, the dash animation itself is pretty sick. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I need you to drop, pretty please. And then pop this. Okay. Almost dead. Okay, he's dead. He's dead. He's dead. He's dead. He's dead. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Wait, I could die again? Oh no. That's what happens when you don't heal your people. Okay. Got this. Get the swirl damage. Nice. Pop the ult. Finisher. I salute you. Have you seen Kamu's coding? It looks like a Shinigami from Bleach. Dude, tell me not. Kamui and Kamu kind of gives like Ichigo and Hichigo vibes. Hollow Ichigo. Just a little bit. I, I got some Bleach vibes from that. I'm just saying. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. I'm here. Dragon Crusher Kai. Welcome to the chat. How you doing? How you doing? Yeah, that's the general consensus. Good for travel, bad for combat. I actually enjoy it for combat. I And I feel like they should keep it. They just got to make it better. So, like, hold on. In 17 seconds, I'll show you what I mean. I actually like the dash a lot. I love the dash a lot. I just wish the first three seconds I went in the dash, it was an iframe. That's all I want. That's all I want, you know? I personally hope they don't change the dash. I love this. Even in combat, I love it. I like the idea of, like, attack, 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 and then going back under, and then popping back out. Like, that's... That's a really cool concept to me, right? It's super different, super unique. The only thing is like you can still get smacked in here and the animation lock from going in and then back out is pretty long compared to just being able to like dash like this, right? Um, You can bunny hop while you're doing a normal dash, but on Ayaka, you can't, right? So, yeah. Believe me, before Aika came in, Mona's Dash was way worse for combat. Oh, I've seen it. I've seen it. I've seen it. Blah. Anyone know if LD player crashes less often than Mumu? Yeah, so like, I, so I've tested both Mumu and LD player on two computers. On one computer, they both ran the same flawlessly. On my computer, Mumu had kept crashing on me and had a few issues personally. Um, LD player ran flawlessly on my computer as well. It, it's, it's really dependent on what build you have, LD player. Is the one I go for. I would try it. That's what I use. Arknight storytelling is like PGR. That's what I've heard. That's what I heard. That's what I heard. That's why I want to try it. Because it looks really good. And even if the gameplay isn't my style. If the story is really good. Like I, I might stick with it. Just for the story. You know. I might. I might. I might. And I, I like tactical games too. I'm not a, I'm not the hugest fan of all tactical games. But. Uh, I played Final Fantasy Tactics. I played every fire, almost every Fire Emblem game. There's a few I haven't. Uh, yeah. Do you know when the Alpha giveaway will happen? We're going to be doing that a few days after Alpha's launch. I'm going to tell you guys on the Ayaka giveaway right now because we don't have too much time before the Ayaka giveaway goes away. We got like literally 12 days. So I'm going to make a video on this in like two days. Okay. But I'm going to tell you right now how to enter the giveaway. Right now. Got it? Cool. All right. Genshin Impact players. If you're a budget or free-to-play player, and I'll tell you what I mean by that, and you do not, if you do not own Ayaka, you are eligible for the Ayaka $150 giveaway that we're going to be doing. We're going to be rolling on your account. So you got to be comfortable with us rolling on your account for the giveaway, right? Um, you have to be subscribed for the channel. You have to leave a comment. Actually, no, no, no. You don't even need to leave a comment on a specific video. You just need to comment on a video. Hashtag. Okay. Here's the hashtag. Uh, UD Ayaka giveaway. That's it. That's all you got to comment. You got to comment it on a video, preferably a Genshin Impact video. Um, UD. Ayaka giveaway. Sadly, I'm on NA server. So, I think we might need to restrict this to NA. But if you're EU, please try. Because I might still be able to do it on EU. I'm going to see if I can figure out a workaround for EU. 
Um, I don't think I can do anything besides NA or EU for the Ayaka giveaway. Here are the rules, real quick, all right? To be eligible for the giveaway, you have to be subscribed for the channel. And I can tell who's subscribed and who's not subscribed on my dashboard, right? Um, and on top of that, you have to leave a comment on a Genshin video. Hashtag UD Ayaka giveaway. You cannot own Ayaka to be eligible for the Ayaka giveaway. If you own Ayaka, you're not eligible for it. This is to help out people that don't have Ayaka. Um... Make sure you ask Genshin first before you do this sort of thing. I already got, I got permission. I got approval. We are good. We are good. We are good. Um, and then you have to be comfortable with us rolling on your account. We will only roll the $150, right? Here's the last rule for you to be eligible. Okay. Hold on. Here's the last rule. Here's the final, final rule. All right. You can't have topped up at all. If you used Moon of the Welkin, and if you used Battle Pass, that's okay. That's fine. But you can't have topped up ever before. And we can see when we go on your account if you topped up, because we're going to top up on your account, right? You cannot have topped up before. This is to help out the people that can't afford to spend on Genshin for the most part, besides a Moon of the Welkin. Or a battle pass. And as to give some of the fam an opportunity to get Ayaka. I personally would love to get a C6 Ayaka. That would be amazing. But I wouldn't be in my position without you guys. So we need to make sure that we share the success with you. And just so we're clear. These giveaways. Unless specifically sponsored by someone. Is not from your guys' donos. This is from ad revenue. So... The people that I've never like donated ever, but you watch the videos, this is thanks to you guys. For everyone that watches the videos, every minute you spend on a video drastically helps us out. And it's the reason why we can do these giveaways. It's the reason why we can do these giveaways, you know? Chaotic is fixing his coding video. What's wrong with the coding video? Was some of the info wrong? I have no info on the, uh, I have no info on the, uh, the, 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 uh, what do you call it? Um, on the coatings. To be honest, I don't know how they work. Just straight up, I have no idea. No clue. I've already topped up and I'm already going to on Raiden's Banner. Hope y'all enjoy. Ooh, you going for Raiden's Banner? Same. Same, 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 same. But yeah, so just to repeat for the giveaway, it's going to be mainly for NA. I'm going to see if I can do it for EU. So if you're EU, please try. You got to comment on a Genshin video. Preferably Genshin and Ayaka related, right? But you got to comment on a Genshin video. Hashtag UD Ayaka giveaway. And you have to be subscribed to the channel. We're going to pick one lucky winner. The rules are you can't own Ayaka at all. Okay. And you cannot have ever topped up before. And it'll let us know because it'll say first time bonus, right? You can't have topped up before. All right. Moon of the Welkin, that's okay. You could use Moon of the Welkin. Battle Pass, if you got in the Battle Pass, that's also totally okay. You just can't top up. That's the only thing. That's the only thing. And this is just to help people out, all right? This is to help out the fam. There's not a lot of people that are able to get Ayaka. I want to help some of y'all out. I'm hoping that as we grow, as we get more views on the videos, the giveaways can be bigger and bigger and bigger. We're also going to be doing... Uh, PGR fam knows a punishing gray raven giveaway for alpha and that's going to be $100 to $150 just depends on this next paycheck we'll see uh, for ad revenue because I'm a little tight right now um, but yeah so it's going to be $100 to $150 black card giveaway we're going to roll on someone's PGR account same rules NA or EU you can't have uh, topped up before right and uh, yeah, we're we're gonna we're gonna try to help out on that details and that giveaway later on, and then we're also doing. Hold on, hold on. There's more. Wait a second. Wait a second. Where is community updates? We're also doing. We've extended this to August fifteenth because a lot of people have joined the Discord and they only just learned about this, so. Doing a fan art contest. We've been running this for the past month and a half. Month 
month-ish, I think. Month and a half, month and a half. Um, there, I've been getting a lot of fan art for free, and it feels really weird to get fan art for free and not give something back to the artist community in the fam. So we're giving away a total of $275 to anyone that's ever gifted us fan art and to anyone that gives us fan art in the future. This ends August 15th. Join the link in the description in Discord. That that can be used on anything. So, yeah, and this is all thanks to you guys, like, supporting the videos and, and leaving a thumbs up and subscribing and, 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 yeah. I seriously appreciate it, man. Seriously appreciate it. Would not be possible without you guys. Would not be possible. Those Arknights Kasana moments definitely have to be clipped. I'm going to be so bad at Arknights in the beginning. So bad at Arknights in the beginning, man. If you need fill the organized tutorial stage, I will laugh so hard. Uh, you know, it's, uh, wouldn't be surprised, man. Wouldn't be surprised. Are you checking your construct from time to time? I am, every day. We gotta get those dorm coins, yup. Yeah, I'd be grinding those dorm coins out for the codings in the future. A thousand percent. I can vouch you the Arknight story really makes you cry and sad. I, A, that just means it's a good storytelling, so I'm hyped for it. I just hope we can stream it. I'm, I want to get email permission that... I, I don't want to stream the game if we can't stream the soundtrack. I don't mind if I get demonetized. If I get demonetized, it's fine. I'm I'm streaming Alchemy Stars and Arknights for fun. Um, but if it's a copyright strike, I can't stream it. I can't risk it. It's too risky. It's too risky. It's too risky. I don't think you can log into someone else's PGR account. We'll we'll get permission for that ahead of time. That's why we don't have like. That's why I'm not confirming that giveaway yet. But I'm gonna be asking for details on that. This man's gonna get crushed in Arcanites? Probably. Probably, probably. How hard is it to raise Ayaka? It's not hard at all. It's very easy. I don't know why people were complaining about uh, raising Ayaka. I, I think they just wanted it insta 90. Like, it it's not hard. Like, it took me a day and a half to get her to 60. Not hard at all. You know? Do you have a feeling it's gonna fail hard, for, uh, is gonna fall hard for Chen in the main event or Saga in the upcoming event? Hey, uh, I saw Chen. Her vibes are pretty dope. Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie, not gonna lie. I thought Arknights was super lenient on copyright regarding music. They had a huge copyright debacle about a year ago. I just don't know if they fixed it just yet. I'm waiting for permission from, um, from Hypergraph and Yostar. I emailed both of them separately two days ago. I'm hoping, you know, I'm hoping, hoping, hoping that will, uh, ends up being a good thing. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Yeah, I think it's uh, going off on a tangent, but kind of related. Um, I think it's interesting how I'm a loud dude by nature. I'm just loud 24-7 for the most part. Pretty emotional guy as well. I'm a crybaby. I'm known to be a crybaby. You guys seen it. Um, but I'm not always like screaming and shouting and all these things. It's just the hype moments in a cinematic, the buildup in a story. That really, really, really gets me, like, hype, hype, you know? And, uh, I feel like a lot of people that don't watch the streams aren't aware, like, that's not how he is on stream 24-7. I'm a loud dude. Uh, that I'll admit. I'm super loud. And I'm very obnoxious. I, I can agree with that. But I'm, I'm definitely not screaming from, from the rooftops 24-7 all stream long. It's just for the hype moments. The hype, bro, you gotta get... I'm, I'm a weirdo. I get hyped about all the things. I'm that sports fan that that Curry. I'm a huge sports fan, by the way. Um, Stephen Curry makes a three-pointer from the halfway point. Two seconds left on the clock. Three men defending him. Dribbles past two guys. Shoots the ball. Two seconds. One seconds. Makes the shot. And I'm losing my mind. You know? I'm that guy. So it just kind of transfers over to gaming as well because I get hyped about gaming the same way I get hyped about sports, you know? Good question. Do you edit your stream or do you post it raw? What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? Like the stream VODs or do you mean like highlights? I'm not, ex I'm not exactly... Uh, not exactly sure. So happy the Bucks won. I'm really happy the Bucks won. Dude. Giannis built different. I'm not gonna go into to sports too too heavy because that's a oh that's a rabbit hole for me. I love basketball, but oh man, that Giannis is just dude is a great god, bro. He's a giant. He's shredded. 
Hey, I don't I don't even know how he's human. I don't think he's human. I think if aliens are real, that man's an alien. Straight up. Oh, like the stream VODs? Oh, I just I just leave it how it is. Leave it how it is. Hey, it's uh that's weird if you I mean I edit highlights. Every now and then I'll make highlight videos. Um, but like the VODs themselves, the stream VODs, they're it's just it's just that, you know? The only time I'll ever edit out like a stream bot is if I is if like I showed something on screen I was not supposed to show and it's like, you know, sensitive info, which I've only done once by accident. Um, in which case then, yeah, I, I, I go back and edit out like those three seconds where I showed that by accident. But I, I've only done that, I think, once, if I'm not mistaken. Please blast. Let's go. I'm new to Arknights, but dang, the CC4 menu music had me vibing. Yeah, I, Arknights music is really nice. Arknights music is really, really, really nice. Like, really good. Like, it blows my mind. And Scotty, uh, Skatey, Skatey, Scotty. I feel like I'm butchering the name. Is best girl. I heard everyone or like a lot of people really like her. Like a lot of people. I got to unlock these teleporter waypoints. So much exploration I got to do. It's kind of crazy. It's really crazy, actually. I'm going to see if I can get to the other, other side of the island. Because what you said last stream made it seem like you edit the VOD for me, at least. Uh, what part? Question mark. We didn't really... Uh, I haven't edited anything on a stream mod in like ages. Ages, ages. I think the last time I had to edit something out was uh when Mehoyo gave me info that like a patch was dropping and they DM'd me and I accidentally showed it on stream for like three seconds and Chaotic DM'd me. He's like, bro, you literally just showed the release date for the patch. Like, you need to go back and edit that part out. I was like, oh, I, I did not even realize that. Um, that was like... Four months ago? Five months ago? So, uh, yeah. I'm, yeah, pretty much. Pretty much, pretty much. You guys can pick one waifu in Arknights. I have, like, 20-plus favorites. I heard they're all pretty good. So many skaties. <laughs> Scotty Sims. Is it Scotty or a skatey? Am I saying it completely wrong? Am I completely off? Whoa. Have I fought these samurai? Yeah, I've definitely fought these samurai before. 1,000%. Ooh, I haven't fought these guys, though. Hold on. Yes, sir. Oh, I forgot it's raining, so they are screwed. Yeah, the perma freeze. Oh, uh, lightning almost killed me. That was kind of scary. Beautiful. Scotty. Skatey. Scott? Scotty? Scotty. Scotty. That sounds like Scott. That sounds like a like a S C O T I E. I feel like I'm not saying that right. I feel like I'm not saying that right. Skating, you'll have the same Japanese voice actor? Mm, that's dangerous. That's very dangerous. Sa. Sa? Sa? Skatey, sir. Skatey. Well, I mean, like, I, I see the I see the spelling, but. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right. I don't think I am. Pretty sure I'm very off. The A right as in Ark Knights. Oh, Scotty. 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 Emphasis on the D, maybe. Question mark. I'm from New York City, so like I have like that northerner accent, which kind of kills a lot of my pronunciation. Um, and it also makes me slur my words a lot, so. Scotty. Ah, Scotty. 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 Got it. Here's the thing is like, so in New York City, we talk so fast and I've practiced a lot. It used to be way worse. I practiced a lot to slow down a lot of my speech. Um, we cut out the end of like every other word we say, which is a good and bad thing. It communicates what we want to say fast, but uh, our pronunciation can be pretty bad too. It's just, it's, it's a New York City like culture thing. It's got its perks. It's got its bad things too. Pop up. Foggers. I gotta switch to my Inazuma fun team because Zhang Li makes this ridiculous COP. Okay, wait a second. Come back down. Okay. Oh, wait, wait, I'm frozen, I'm frozen. Move, move. 
No! You messed me up, brother. Okay, bro. He's that dude. Wait, Cryo Fatui is actually so dangerous. I'm gonna freeze you. I'm gonna kill you first. And then I'm gonna pop this. Oh my god, Cryo Fatui, stop, brother. Give me out, 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 give me out. No! Now I know what it feels like to be uh the enemy being permafrozen in the rain. Now I understand their pain. I get it. I'm gonna freeze all of you. Okay, pop up. Okay, okay, listen. It's not nice to freeze people. I understand I'm freezing you. I get it. I understand. But can you not freeze me? Pretty please? Just gonna pop this. Okay, I'm actually in trouble because I have nothing to I have nothing to shred a shield besides uh Electro Traveler. Mm, dude, Cryo Fatui is so OP here. Oh my god. Okay. Bro, there's nothing to shred his shield. I can't fight him. I can't beat him. Alright, I'm just come I'm gonna just take this electro oculi and dip. That's all I can do. That's all I can do. I gotta run! No! I'll have my revenge. One day. One day, one day. Bro, all of you talking about Arknights makes me want to stream it so bad. I've been wanting to stream Arknights and Alchemy Stars so badly, dude. So freaking badly. Like, I can't wait, brother. I can't wait to be able to stream those. Yo, what are your thoughts on Yoi Mia? Like her or not, I think she's dope. I, I played her a little bit during the story. Dude, her combat is freaking awesome. Not gonna lie. Also, Yoi Mia is my bestie in Genshin Impact. I am her uh, VIP security bodyguard, so... You guys would like a date with Yoimiya? I can respect that. Very charming. That's the head of the snake. That's a big head. I, I that that kind of like shook me. I'm not gonna lie. I thought it was about, I thought it was about to get eaten alive. Oh my! I didn't know we could travel to the skull. I have so much to explore, man. It's crazy. I didn't even know. Holy heck! The thing is huge. Bro, and ball slice it in half with one strike. That's one scary odd woman. Sheesh, man. You can't be that pretty and that deadly. That, that is not, that is a scary combination. You know what I'm saying? Can we go inside? I didn't even know we could go there. I'm like blown away. My mind is... So, sorry for like pausing. I'm just... Oh, there's like... How do we open these? What? What the heck, dude? That's crazy. Okay. I wasn't expecting all that, to be honest with you. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Huh. Oh, Magu Kenki, what's good, my dude? I don't gotta fight you anymore because Kaz was already 90, but um how you doing? How is your day going? I'm just gonna don't mind me. I'm just gonna go around. No 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 no, it's okay. You can you can you can sit in the rain, that's fine. Hey, by the way, uh pu what Mehoyo? Can we talk? Why the puppet strings? What what's up with you and puppets lately? What's up with you and puppets lately? New patch comes out, we get an enemy that has puppet strings. New patch for Honkai comes out, we get an enemy with puppet strings. You got a fascination with puppets that... Y'all be watching way too much Chucky in the middle of the night. You gotta chill out, okay? I don't know, uh... Uh, yeah. I don't know. It's it, it, kinda weird. 
Og Knights has an enemy that uses a katana and they hit so hard. Is, are there any characters? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, my God. We're running. We're out of here. Goodbye. Adios. No, I'm good. I'm chilling. Y'all can... No! Chill. What have I ever done to you? Ooh, where am I? Dude, Inazuma's so freaking cool. Holy heck. Dude, that's so sick. I don't even mind. Oh, wait, hold on. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I saw an electro oculi in my face. It's gonna drive me insane. I can't get th to there. Uh, one day. One day. I'll get it one day. I'll get it one day. Dude. Okay. Hold up. Dope. Teleporter. Beautiful. Okay, we got what we came for there. I need a teleporter up here. I gotta get to this shrine, but first, let me actually get to this teleporter. There's a crap ton of people who use modernized katanas. Ooh, that's hype, dude. Heck yeah. That's hype, that's hype. Well, I mean, from what I understand, uh, um, what was I gonna say? From what I understand, you need like a, it's like Fire Emblem. You, it's not just one character. It's not one character or a few characters. You have like a roster of like eight or ten people to clear a, to clear like an Arknights quest. Um, and there isn't too much power creep in Arknights. I don't know if that's true or not, but that's 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 the consensus that I've been seeing. Um, yeah, so that's that's super dope, actually. Do you want us to backseat or do you want to figure it out on your own? I haven't decided. I'll be honest. Uh, I'll be honest. I think I kind of want to figure it out on my own. I, like, I think the cool thing about strategy games, I might tilt the heck out of you guys. I'll be real with you. I can be a bit of Papega, not gonna lie. But, and I like to be very unorthodox with the way I figure stuff out. But, um, yeah, I think I'm just gonna, I, I wanna figure out Arknight's stuff on my own. Every now and then I'll ask for like some advice or some help, but I think for the most part, probably on my own. Ooh, so we face it all one way. Got you. You can just use three star ops until chapter three. Uh, there's a there's a lady that's on banner right now. That's kind of tempting me to play it right now. Uh, her name is Suter. S U T R. Uh, she looks really good. Is all I'm gonna say. All I'm gonna say. Oh wait, did that bring the the barrier down? Oh, it did. Huh. Interesting. And uh, yeah, and I, I really want Suter. Su Suter? Su Su TR? Uh, I don't know how to say it. <clears throat> Suter is a monster in the meta. Oh, Poggers! Wait, that's actually so hype. So I should go for her. That's even more tempting. Oh, man. Suter is waifu and powerful. How do I make the coffee in the link below? Oh, Damien, depends what coffee you're making. If you're in the Discord, and I think you are... It's because I, I, I started talking about Suter, right, Ball? Is that why? I started talking about an Arknight's waifu. I didn't even say she was my waifu. I started talking about Arknight's, an Arknight's waifu. And Ball assumes that um, I'm saying... Bro, I didn't even say she was my waifu. And Ball striked me out in the middle of... I can't even talk about another character without ball smacking me, dude. Sheesh. Like, I already said I'm gonna see three you, probably see six you, because of how freaking beautiful you are. Like, oh, man. <laughs> uh, you know, it is what it is, I guess. This is some I will strike twice energy. Yeah, you're not wrong. You're not wrong. You're not wrong. Wait, what did you get for uh, your starting six star? In uh, in what? In Arknights? I haven't played Arknights yet. I haven't haven't started just yet. Just yet, just yet. I can't wait to start it. That's gonna be pretty hype. Um, yeah, I haven't really uh, haven't really started playing yet. I really want to. I'm just scared with the copyright stuff, man. I don't want to get copyright strike. I don't want to make like four videos on it or like three streams and then. It's just like, strike, 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 and the channel's gone. 
you know? And then same for Alchemy Stars. I really want to do Alchemy Stars too. Here's the thing. So like, I like how we're talking about other games. That's pretty dope, actually. This is just a chill hangout stream, by the way. This isn't like a Genshin content focus. We're just vibing. We're talking gaming. That's what we're doing. Uh, let me show you guys. Let's get some music playing in the background real quick. Hold on. Genshin Impact OST. No. Here's why I want to play Arknights and, and Alchemy Stars right now, especially. Like, right now, more than I've ever wanted to. Here's why. I could be wrong. Correct me if I'm wrong. Suitor. Sutor. Su. 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 Tr. I don't know how to say it. I'm bad with names. I was trained at Starbucks for a little bit. Uh, they, they teach us to butcher names, so. <clears throat> uh, yeah, she looks really cool. I like fire, and uh, she's got mad drip, so. This is what, re dude, this is what really, like, shush. Uh, Hold on, saw something y'all are not supposed to see. Wait a second. <laughs> I can't show, that's a demonetized right there. Uh-oh. That was Monkas. Big Monkas in the chat. Big Monkas in the chat. TOS. That was scary. Y'all didn't see nothing. That was spooky. That was spooky, spooky. Where is it? Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Okay. Bro, street fashion and like just urban fashion in general, yes. You know what I'm saying? Hundred percent. Like the 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 brick wall with the graffiti in the back, like, dude, dude, that's so freaking cool. And then I heard that she's on a banner right now, right? And then on top of that, on top of that, uh, hero alchemy stars. This character is about to drop or just dropped. And y'all know I love Katana characters. And she just came out. And dude, Katana. Like, bro, Chad vibes. You know what I'm saying? Chad vibes. Chad vibes, Chad vibes. Is, uh, yeah, she's on Banner. She's out after maintenance. Oh, so, so, uh, who's out? Suitor or Hero? I think this is Hero. Suitor is sharing a rate up with another six star, so it's a 50 50. Oh, it's a 50 50. That's tough. I might not be able to get her then. Now, that's a, bro, that's a, that's a blade right there. You know what I'm saying? That's a blade. That's a plate. That's a blade. Oh, you know who's another dope character I really wanna, I really wanna get? In Arknights. Arc Knights. Uh, Y'all just reminded me in the chat. There's two. There's one that just got revealed. This dude's got mad drip. Brother, can we talk about your drip real quick? Can we talk about Arc Knights' graphic designer? Sheesh, man. The graphic designer is crazy. Not The artist is amazing too, but the graphic designer is in charge of like all this. The, the background and, and the letters and the typography. Uh, Thorn, bro. Man's got drip. Drip God, sheesh, brother. Representing the handsome Middle Eastern, possibly Egyptian, African. Uh, man is handsome. And given us colored brothers representation that we deserve. Granted, I'm pale right now because I haven't been able to go out. But I get very, very, very dark in the summer. Don't don't freak out if I if you see me come on stream and I'm like, like dark. I, I tan very fast and I lose my tan very fast and I get dark so don't freak out if I ever like come on very dark you know it's a it's a Hispanic thing we 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 tan very quickly I'm Colombian so Colombian skin tends to yeah right now I'm pretty I'm pretty pale for the most part I haven't been able to go out much because COVID so I don't travel as much as I used to alter ego dreamer nah this man man this man is way too handsome dude 
Way too handsome, brother. Like, she... Uh, can I get this fit, by the way? You see this fit? That's a nice fit. I want the shorts. I want the shirt. The shirt, pretty basic for the most part. But it's a simple, clean design. I want the shorts. Dude, the shorts is a yes for me, brother. Goodness gracious, man. Like, you know how usually I want a wingman for people? I don't want a wingman for this guy. I want him to wingman for me. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like... Dang, dude. Going to so chat. He's the only operator who did not apply for Rhodes Island to become an operator. We invited him. That's dope. That's pretty sick, actually. For Alchemy Stars, check out Sharona. 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 Alchemy Stars. Ooh, damn. Okay. Yeah, I want I want her. Or that's definitely a her. I think I want her. She looks dope. Damn. Oh, that's a necessary bro. Hello. She's got like flames coming out. Oh, dude, that looks so sick. What? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Wait a minute. Dude, I'm trying to get like the full image blown up. Yo, that's dope. I love katana people, man. I love katana people. Why don't you use contact lenses? I can take a punch to the face. Uh, I can. I, I'm I'm cool with getting you know getting down and and roughed up in a fight. Uh, I've been in a lot of street fights. Been in a lot of situations probably shouldn't have been in. For the life of me, I don't know why I'm such a scaredy cat to putting contact lenses in my eyes. I don't know why. I have no idea. I, bro, like, I don't know. I can't do it. I tried. I can't do it. I also like glasses a lot. I'm a big glasses guy, but I can't do it. I tried. I'd be like, you see, you ever see me try to put contacts on? I'm like, oh, no, just... Just do it. Just I can never do it, dude. I'm such a baby with with contacts. I don't know why. I'm such a baby with contacts. It's weird. It's weird, weird. Really, really freaking weird. You know. Glasses make you do that. Hundred <laughs> percent, Otter. I appreciate that, man. Oh uh, man, that's kind of funny. I overcame my fear of contacts for virtual reality games. What do you mean? Virtual reality games don't scare me, but uh, contacts, that scares me. I'm not gonna lie. I'm a baby when it comes to that. I don't know why, but I am. UD, your real name? Diego Del Real. Also, the English version of that is Diego and then Del Real. Just gotta, gotta roll the R with the... It's not real, it's real, you know, like del real. Yeah. That's that's the name, man. That's my full name is complicated as heck. Diego Gerardo Tofi del Real. You know? Katana UD, alright. Utage, chaotic will lover, and Helagur or Sephiroth. In Arknights? Question mark? You need to check out Heliger Arknight. Heliger Arknight. Helig Heliger. 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 Arknights. I feel like I'm saying that wrong too. I'm butchering the names. I'm so sorry. Ah, I don't, is that a katana? That is a katana. Technically speaking, that is a katana. It's a big katana. Is it a katana? I don't even know. Man, man be... Uh, what's... At that point, that's not a katana. That's a... That's a... What's the word? I don't even know. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> uh... There's a word for it. There's a word for it. There's a word for it. He looks kind of chad. He looks kind of chat. This dude looks like he gets shot in the eye and he like doesn't flinch. That's the vibe this dude gets me. Mm-hmm. 
Chad vibes. Norachi, 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 Norachi. He's a war hero, UD. I, he looks like it. Oh, bro. This this one picture alone might have just like made him a dude. That's so freaking dope. That's such a wholesome picture, man. That's like big brother, like mentor vibes right there. Oh, dude. I'm a sucker for family stuff, man. I'm a sucker for family stuff. Well, we kind of went off topic. We didn't really do much Genshin. We were just kind of vibing and chatting. Um, it's one in the morning. We're going to end stream there. I really want to do Arc Knights. I really want to do Alchemy Stars. Let me know what you guys think. Let me know if you got any information on the copyright stuff. And uh, we're going we're gonna to call it a day there. We're going to call it a day there, fam. We're going to call it a day there. Pro I'll probably retitle this video to... Arc Knights, Alchemy Stars, chat. I'm going to have to retitle this video so people don't get, you know, misunderstood with the VOD, most likely, but. Silphi Akafuyu is the real samurai. How the girl in Utage normal can't be healed, they heal themselves. Ooh, nice. Yeah, this was a very off-topic stream. We kind of went everywhere. We went everywhere, dude. We talked about Gen. We talked about Genshin. We had the the Ayaka giveaway that we talked about. I'll be making a detailed video on that, but we we talked about the details on that earlier. So, you know, you're fine as long as you turn off the ad slash monetize thing on Arc Knight stream. Yeah, I'm not too worried about that. I'm just worried about copyright strikes. I want to make sure that we're not getting striked when we make content. You know, I emailed Yo Stars and Hypergraph, and then um. I haven't emailed Alchemy Stars just yet, but they don't seem very friendly on it. I just want to make sure they're not copyright striking. I want to enjoy the in-game music with you guys. That's like part of the, the enjoyment of games, you know? How's the jacket after a while aware? Oh, it's pretty good. So it feels amazing. It's not a thick jacket, so it doesn't feel... It doesn't get you hot. It's not something you would wear for like... like you could wear it on a chilly day if it's like just a light breeze, 60 degrees. But for the most part, you wouldn't really wear this on like a 50 or 40 day, you know? 50 or 40 day. All right, fam, we're going to end the stream there. Thank you for hanging out. It's 1 a.m. I'm going to get dinner numero dos because I am starving. And uh, thank you so much for the support. Seriously appreciate the video. Uh, Chaotic streaming right now, and he's getting some information straight on the new skins for PGR coming in the future. Coding skins. Um, I'm not sure what he got wrong, or maybe he got additional information. I have no idea. Check his stream out. Awesome, dude. And uh, deuces. Peace out. Love you guys. Have a great night. Thank you for the support. Thank you so much. Slayer, my dude. Thank you for the gifts. I seriously appreciate it. I'm wearing this tonight and you will see me wearing this in the future in streams and the Kiana jacket, especially in Honkai streams. Dusk, Katana. Okay, Dusk sounds really cool. I like sunsets and Dusk kind of. Dusk, Dusk, Arknights. Real quick, last thing, last thing. Last thing I'm gonna do. Who is she? Okay, she looks pretty cool. It's more of a sword, but she looks dope. She's got like the... I don't know if it's Japanese or Chinese, but regardless, she's got like the... Tra Ooh, she's got the traditional ink vibes. Okay. Oh, she's got a Shao color palette. That's probably why I'm really vibing with her. Okay, now I really want Dusk. How do we get Dusk? Nah, she looks dope. Chinese, I believe. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. Dude. Oh my god. Her drip, bro. You see the jacket? Sheesh. Damn. <laughs> anyways. <clears throat> uh, anyways. 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 Uh... Bro, that alone really wants to. I, I, dude, now I really want to get into the game. I think I think y'all just sold me with Dusk, dude. What the hell? All right. Well, anyways, love you guys. Doses. Have a great night. And <laughs> you guys are evil, making you fall more in the God Show. <laughs> oh man. All right, guys. Love y'all. Doses. Have a great night. Thanks for checking out the stream. Thank you so much for for. Uh, even wanting to send me stuff, it, it means the absolute world. I'm, I, I swear I'm going to cherish this a ton. And, uh, yeah. Appreciate y'all. Have a good night.
Peace out. Till next time. Honkai stream tomorrow night and and maybe uh Maybe an Arknight stream tomorrow wouldn't hurt. Before the Honkai stream. What do y'all think? Bro, art is so freaking cool. Why do I like swords so much? Mm. When does dust come out? When does dust come out? Question mark. When does dust come out? I don't care if I if we get copyrighted, we get copyrighted. It is what it is. I don't mind. I don't mind. I don't mind. I don't mind. Worst case, we take down the we take down the vod. We take down the stream. Hopefully, Ark Knights team global team can help brother out and make sure we don't get copyrighted that would be awesome as long as we don't get bonked then yeah two days two days two days so not tomorrow two days two days in two days she comes out july 30th wait that's tomorrow that's technically tomorrow well i mean like te like it's technically it just became the 29th so it's all of today and then the next day. The, th the 30th? Hmm. Hmm. How hard is it to get dusk? Is it hard? You would get a free 10 rolls for her banner, by the way. That's dope. That's really dope. Suter is available till August 6th. Yeah, Suter and Dusk are, are definitely two I really want to get. 10 pull free and every day is a free one. We'll get 10 free roll. 300 pulls is the guarantee? What? How much is 300 pulls? That sounds scary. I don't know if... Maybe that's not that much. Maybe... Well, okay. The rate is actually pretty nice, though. The rate is 2%. The rate is 2%. After 50 pulls, this rate has increased every one pull. How much does it increase? That sounds... Yeesh. I don't know if we'll be able to get that. I'm so used to maybe that's amazing though, because two percent's way better than like 0. 0.6, which is what we get. It's pretty that's pretty brutal. Hundred pools is the one hundred percent guarantee for a six star. Oh, that's not too bad. Hundred is hard pity. Oh, that's not bad. That's not bad. That's not bad. That's not bad then. I thought there was no guarantee and you just like you win. That's not bad. I thought I I read like 300. I was like, what? 300 pools? Increases like 2%. Oh, that's not too... That's actually kind of nice. On average, you should get dusk in about 120 pulls. I'm reading different things, but we'll, we'll, we'll talk in the... We'll talk in the Discord. 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 We'll see. However, there is no guarantee which of the two featured six-star characters. Oh, got you. That makes sense. That's kind of scary. I guess we'll figure it out, right? Okay, so you'll see an Ark Knight stream in the next like day or two, possibly, most likely. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. In the most, I can't believe y'all got me with Dusk. Like I was already tempted with Suter, but Dusk looks dope. The traditional like. That's so freaking dope. I love. I I love like Chinese culture and all that and. Even Japanese culture, like just the traditional like aesthetic is just so freaking sick, man. That's so cool. Can't believe y'all got me. Can't believe y'all got me. All right. Doses. Love you guys. Have a great night. Peace out. For any Ark Knights people, if y'all can like go to hashtag gotcha gaming channel in the Discord link in the description and help a brother out, 
Uh, seriously appreciate it. And then the same for Alchemy Stars, people. Um, feel free to ping me. Love you guys. Deuces. Have a good night. Peace out. I've said that like 20 times. I'm sorry. Adios. Man, Dusk looks so freaking.